Hey, what's up, everybody? RJ back with another review today. I'm going to review uh, my first game review. It's going to be uh, Army of Two for the Xbox 360. This is Army of Two, the 40th day, the second Army of Two for the Xbox 360 console. Uh, this this game uh, is basically, you know, developed all around co-op experience. You and a buddy going through story mode and stuff. There's online too. We'll talk about that in a second. Uh, you play as Tyson. Uh, you, talk, you play as Rios and Salem again. The same people from the first one. Uh, you get you get stuck in a uh, in a city. And basically, throughout seven chapters of gameplay, you fight your way through the city. All right? The first chapter, you're pretty much training, like you know most games are. And then you move on to chapter two, which uh, which basically uh, the the city you're in starts really getting torn up. You know, it wasn't in that great shape when you got there in the first place, because in the beginning you see a cutscene, the place is getting torn up. But it happens. Uh, the lady that you're with, uh, I'm trying to remember her name. Uh, I don't remember her name, but the lady that you're with in the uh the first game the one that gives you all the intel and stuff she gets kidnapped so the first few chapters are about rescuing her and then after that you uh you're on a non-stop mission to try to get your own way out of there and you know and stop these uh these terrorists from doing things so at the end it's pretty uh i don't want to tell exactly how it ends but there's three endings and there's a couple of them are pretty intense so so I'll leave that part to that. Uh, as far as weapons goes, uh, there's a lot of weapons. There's not very many pistols. There's only three pistols in the game. I mean, it's got all the good weapons from last time, pretty much. Now, I've seen a lot of reviews on this game where they say you can't, you can only have, you know, a pistol and one weapon. That's not necessarily true. You can automatically hit X on a weapon and automatically listen to your specialties class. So that that's not true at all. And uh, as far as the uh, co-op gameplay, it's pretty solid. When I first got the game, though, I was getting lagged out a lot, and it was pausing for random reasons, but they fixed that later. But uh, every now and then, I still got kicked out, but but for the most part, it was pretty good. You know, uh, toward the end of me actually beating the game, I, I had no problems at all. It fixed itself and everything, but servers, uh, servers started off a little rocky, like I said, but at the end, it ended up being a pretty good game experience. I was pretty happy with it. As far as online goes on this game, uh, it consists of Team Deathmatch Extraction if you uh, pre-ordered it. Otherwise, you'll get that a month from now or something like that, they said. But you'll be able to have it eventually yourself. And it pretty much has different game modes online. And they all consist of teamwork, you and one other friend, against those people like Deathmatch. It's not like you versus you know other people. It's you and a friend versus other teams of two. It's deathmatch, but you have a partner that is your teammate. So, I mean, you can customize your masks online and stuff, but uh, but other than that, it's it's a lot like the first one. I, I like I said, I enjoyed it a lot actually. At first, I was getting pretty angry with it because all the cutting out and stuff. But uh, if you uh, if you're wary of the servers and stuff, like I said, it. it it's better than it was, but if you're looking with servers, I suggest at least renting it and trying it out. If you like the first one, at least try this one. Because, uh, I mean, I had one friend that took it back because he couldn't take the server so much. So, I mean, servers that are, you know, what they are. Sometimes they're good, sometimes they're not. But but all, all around, it's, it's a good co-op experience. When the servers are going good, it's, it's a very good co-op experience. Very good. I think you'll enjoy it. Uh, this has been my quick review. There's the disc real quick. You want to see it? There you go. Uh, this has been my quick review of the Xbox 360 uh, version of Army of 240th Day. I'm RJ. Thanks for watching.